Thank you, Nick. As the healthcare field sees a worker shortage, hospitals are doing the best they can to help patients. Our David Pierce has more on what this looks like and how local colleges are filling in the gaps. I spoke with both Parkland and Lincoln Land Community College and both say more students are answering the call. So they're making sure they produce more staff members who can provide the highest level of care. Parkland College says interest has grown over the years with certifications rising from 368 in the 2019-2020 school year to more than 428 last year. Now 140 more students are graduating this month. But without those new faces making an entrance, Kim Pancall at Parkland College says organizations facing a staff shortage may rely on who they can. Is that when facilities can't find um, people to work, then they start doing internal training. Pancall says while that may be their best solution for the time being, it's important to have certified graduates ready to take a specific role. But our, our programs that we offer here are accredited programs that offer a certificate that, um, you know, that you, somebody has been licensed, they've gone through an intense program, which is always better for patient care. In Springfield, Lincoln Land Community College says enrollment in their nursing program grew by over 25 percent. And this month, 170 students are also heading out of their doors. Dean Cynthia Maskey says methods and technology in healthcare are constantly evolving, so they're making sure students are prepared. We have to be current, cutting edge in what we're teaching so that then those students that we graduate are ready to go and be current practitioners. So, and, and that applies to all the programs. Both colleges say assistance is available, whether it be scholarships or career coaches to help students graduate. I'm David Pierce reporting in studio. Back to you. Thank you, David. Both colleges say students will likely have a job when they graduate. Parkland added that students could get sign-on bonuses of around $5,000.